PR7, the 2021 model. It's the green one. I painted the uh, front fairing black. Just, this is too green up there. Added the green grips. Um, I just chopped the handlebars and ground down the weld and repainted that last night. I just couldn't stand that crossbar. As uh, another YouTuber said, remind him of a Huffy. <laughs> yeah, that, that's gone. But I have a tachometer coming too, and I need to make space for it. <laughs> I had this panel off for a little bit and just ran with this one to have like a naked look. I liked that. I kind of really like that. I might go back to that. First motorcycle, I like it. Definitely like it. It was, it was if, if you like to tinker, I chopped that. If you like to tinker, this is perfect for you. It's the perfect bike for you if you like to tinker. Because number one, you need to go over the every single nut and bolt, according to ChinaRiders.net and multiple users on YouTube and every every assembly video I've seen. You need to once you receive this, even though it's like eighty percent assembled, you need to go over every single nut and bolt again. But to give credit to Tao Tao, whoever did the initial assembly, the only bolts I found that were loose were two on one foot peg. I put a double nut on the rear as a safety precaution, as a lock, so that doesn't move at all, because I am not taking chances. This was way more forward when I received it, and I kept like my it was like irritating my leg when I was trying to hug the tank, it was just like right there. So I, I loosened this up and I, I took it off and moved it back, maybe from like you know, just like five degrees, five to ten degrees. <laughs> tooth front sprocket and a 40 tooth rear sprocket uh, I was cruising at like 60 miles per hour earlier um, I could definitely probably hit 70 I'm still breaking the bike in so I haven't really tried to hit 70 but stock carburetor um, did the whole mod where or I, I used a Dremel tool to get into the um, like safety screws the non tamper screws um, I've got a one 115 jet in there, 115 or 110, I think I'm 110, I believe it was a 110. Uh, the exhaust came in, TPR7. Went right on for the most part. Had to make a little bracket. It was right there. And I just completely grinded out one side, just like 
took the hole and went straight out. On the other side, I, I opened it up a little bit, but for the most part, it was easier just to grind out and opening. Uh, and just tighten it down as much as I can. And sounds good.